Good morning, guys. Stephen Blake here with Clay McShane. Good morning. We are off on our travels again. I know I said we're going to be on my travels to Hisarano, but Clay, we didn't really actually film much in Hisarano, did we? Just a few goats, as you'll see in the previous one. We filmed the goats. Did we even film the goats or did we take pictures? Anyhow, if we didn't film goats or we only took pictures, then you'll see them in the previous video. It'll either be pictures or it'll be a video, I can't remember. So today, we are going to Fetier. We're going to Fetier to have a look around. Apparently there's a harbour there, um, which is supposed to be nice. Uh, which I can imagine if there's a harbour, it's going to be nice and cool, Clay, with a breeze. So that's what we're after because it's hot. I think the hottest today is going to be 35 Celsius. Um, so we're sweating, as you can see. We're walking down the big hill where we are stopping from. We're going to catch a dolmosh, which are about two lira if you want to go to Hisaranu, which is about one pound 20. One pound 20, no, no, it's not one pound 20, I'm lying. It's about, Claire, what is it? It's one pound, it's four, four point five lira to the pound. So it's about, 50 pence, 60 pence, 50 pence, 45 pence, 50 pence to go on the Dolmosh to get anywhere you want. So if we're going for one for about, we're going to go to Fetty, which I think is going to cost about a pound travel. I mean, why can't we do that in the UK? It costs about £2.20, £2.30 just to get from my house to the town centre. Uh, and it's like one pound to get a miles away here. So anyhow, we're going to Fetty. And then I think we're going to go to try and go to the Kaya village, which apparently is an old, or Kakoi village or whatever they call it, which apparently is an old village. Um, it's an old village where the Greeks used to own until they abandoned it in 1922, I think it was. And then some Turkish people lived in it for a little while. And then after that, they kind of abandoned it. But apparently there still is people living around there. It's still inhabited by people. Although they try to turn around and see nobody lives there. But we shall see. So that's what's happening today. Hi guys. So we are here in Fetier. And uh, Hi, my name is Mustafa. This is my shop. You can't forget. Is that your shop? I'm from England, yeah. I'm a, vid a video blogger. Ah. On YouTube. Can I ask, can I ask one question? Please? What? Why not many English people here now? Um. It's very quiet. It's uh, so as you can see, we are in the fish market. You can see all the fruit. There's lots of fresh fruit, and if you look around, you've got all this fresh. Now we never see fresh England fish like this in England very often. Fresh prawns, fresh shrimp, fresh fish. If you want to give information about the fish market, information about the fish market. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Have you been before here? No. Oh. Yeah, isn't it? I have to use to. I hate this job. You can Have you lost your nose? <laughs> <laughs> Hi again. I've so, never seen fish fresh as fresh as this in England. Uh, oh, here it is every day they catch an egg. Yeah. Yeah. From every store next to next to each other. And this, this is the art store. Only the people passing the fish market. We have, we have both. We catching ourselves. We don't buy in large areas. So what do you do? Why? Do why do you just sell fish in the middle of the square? Sorry? What happens? What, what, you've got all these restaurants around here and then you've got fish in the middle. Yeah, yeah. Why? Because you can choose from here, across Calamari, forever you like. And uh -huh. see, you can pick up, we have some about 10 or 12 restaurants around here. You can pick up one of them and they cook for you 6 lira per person. Oh, so you buy the fish here then you cook yeah. it over there for 6 lira? That's right, yeah. Oh, that's cool, right? That, isn't it? Yeah. So... I think we only, we only often to have something to eat for fish. Yeah, well we've just yeah. came now, so yeah, we're just going to have a look around. We walk in and we've just been pulled into the first shop we've got. You should try, you should try, it's working really nice over here, yeah. rice fish. And they give you bread, salad, something like that, garlic butter, and like that in three yeah. yeah. I don't know where you're getting your accent from, but your accent just changed there. Why? Because you started putting a London accent on. <laughs> yeah, I'm staying which time in London. Oh yeah. Uh, in London, I'm staying there all that. Yeah. So why come over back over here? Because this is my country. I, wasn't I have to say that they, Claire, what do you think of all that fish? Claire just found out what a tuna looks like, so now she's um, she's never going to eat tuna ever again. Unfortunately, um, she's 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 only ever had it from a tin. So these fish markets are really, really nice. As you can see, the guy said, he's told well, what happens, you get the fish, you pick your own fish, and then you pay six lira to get the fish cooked. 
in a restaurant. Um, yeah, so now we're going to have a look at some toys and some so, gifts. So, the guy in the shop just managed to get with a buy some Turkish tea, some lots of Turkish tea. Um, he tried to sell with one thing for 50 lira and then he tried to sell us something else for 20 lira but then I asked him what the tea, four packets of tea by itself was. Watch with it, clear. And he says they were, um, hold on. He says they were uh, 25 lira. So I thought to myself, if I buy the little one for 20 lira, the big one for 25 lira, then it only come to 45 lira rather than paying 50 lira for the pack. So you've got to watch out these things because sometimes it's cheaper to get two different ones than it is to get one separate one. Um, so yes, that's what's happening. So today we are now having a look at more shops. So we're going to get some lunch and a drink because I'm so hot. We're going to go to the harbour. Hello. Hello. It's alright, I'm not, I'm just trying to face. Which way is it to the harbour? Harbour here. That way? Yeah. Just here? Yeah. yeah. Alright, thank you. I think you have looked down that way. Which way does it look? Which way looks nice? Wow. Should we go in here? It looks nice, doesn't it? Guys, we're here on the harbour in Fethier and we found this drink. Now it's called a frozen. And what this one is, is it's lemon, like a lemonade with ice and stuff, but then it's got like a mint syrup that's floating on the top. So when you're tasting it, you're tasting the lemon, but you're tasting like a hint of mint. But it's not like the mint that's in the it is the mint that's in the um it's hard to explain clay got the, the raspberry one. The mixed berry one. It's a nice clay. Yes. But it's, it's such a weird taste. So here we are at Fedi Harbour again. We're just having a walk along. What do you think of it, Clay? It's beautiful. Beautiful, isn't it? It's so hot though. Very hot today. Um, this is unusual. Look at all the umbrellas. On the ceiling. This is quite amazing. The floating umbrellas. So nice, isn't it? 